our nlc girls higher secondary school is the first government aided school to set up the virtual reality lab in tamil nadu so thank you very much our most honorable cmd sir most respected director sir director hr sir most respected secretary sir for giving this wonderful vr lab Today is a golden day in the history of NLC Girls Higher Secondary School. We celebrate the diamond jubilee of this great institution today. I am filled with pride and joy and deem it a great honor to welcome the most esteemed chief guest, CMD NLCIL, Director HR NLCIL, CGM TA, Secretary NLC Schools, GM Education, Sports and Culture, Common School Committee members and other NLCIL officials who have graced this occasion to partake of our joy. HM Shreemati R.S. Manimuri. She is a legendary HM who took the school to new heights of fame during her tenure of 11 years from 2002 to 2013. In 1958, Plant City was formed like Chandigarh for the employees and their families were nicely placed in pleasant quarters to educate the, their children an elementary school in block 24 and a high school in block 10 was started and in 1963 to motivate girl children education girls high school was formed in a vast area very good building was built in 1978 the school was upgraded as higher secondary school we all worked in 1979 we Fresh from the college, we entered the premises. I in due, till the new classrooms were built, in, till 1984 to 85, uh, we functioned in a shift system. 11th and 12th standard classes attended in morning shift. 6 to 10th standard classes conduct, were conducted in the second shift. Uh, our campus turned into uh, beautiful pl flower carpets in every spring season. We were proudly working in this pleasant atmosphere. May I now request our most respected guest of honor, Sri Samir Swaro, to deliver this speech. Today, we are celebrating a journey of knowledge and the unwavering commitment towards shaping the young minds. Let this celebration be a reminder that the journey does not end here. It merely takes a new and exciting beginning. As we get on to the next chapter, let us pledge 
to uphold the spirit of NLC Girls Higher Secondary School, carry forward the values of the institution, and to contribute meaningfully to the way of world beyond these walls. May I now request our most respected chief guest, CMD sir, to deliver his speech. Any call of an account. My dear colleague director, Samir Swarovji, Srimati Yam Santamare, the current headmistress, headmistress, who is really behind the success of this school now. And former headmistresses and teaching staff who laid the path for this success and progress. And my dear children and parents, in this hall, I am not seeing students of Naivali School. I am seeing the girl power which is going to translate this country into a developed state by 2047 as per dream of Honorable Prime Minister. So I think your management should start writing girl power on your uniform. Like you must have, you must have observed in, Indian, in uh, Indigo Airlines, all air forces, they write girl power here. That is true reflection. India is going, targeting to become a developed country by 2047. That is only possible by giving proper empowerment to the girl child, girl children and women. Even without any support, they are doing wonders. So with little support, they can make more wonders and take India as the best country in the world. I feel very happy to inaugurate the Diamond Jubilee celebrations of this school and also Virtual Reality Lab. It is really a marvelous achievement. I remember my school days where we studied in schools, where there are no benches also for sitting and the classes were being conducted under trees and in huts and if there is rain, no school. Such type of school, studying in such type, such type of schools, if we could achieve so many laurels with so many facilities, with so much infrastructure support, with so much support from the teachers. The sky is the only limit for your achievements. My request to all the teachers, all the students is to take advantage of this facilities available, the teachers available, the knowledge that teachers are having to maximum extent to ensure that you study and develop in all the areas. On this occasion, my hearty greetings to all girl students for the International Day of Girl Child observed on 10th October 2023. Pengal Nadina Kantar. There is saying, if you educate a man, you educate an individual. But if you educate a woman, you educate the entire family. And sometimes the entire street. I was hearing and I was seeing the students who talked here about the most relevant topics. And I was really astonished 
to see their confidence levels and their capabilities it's really marvelous that shows the standard of the school the culture of the school and the standard of the teachers the school is having at the outset i thank you all for giving an outstanding welcome whatever is there in the school in each and every corner is really excellent and all schools have to follow i was observing number of good quotes that are written here so it is a nice gesture but only thing is that uh, we have to follow whatever is written in all those displays see naively always believes in inclusive growth along with the growth of the company the employees the workmen the contract labor all the people across around naively all those should develop i am very glad to know that the school was started in 1963 with a mere strength of 100 students as on date you are having more than 2000 students which is really a great achievement and the credit goes to all the head misses and the teachers sitting here who made that credibility and students prepared to join this school during her speech the current head misses asked for some support from nld management nld is always with development of all the schools and particularly the development of the schools who are performing so whatever is asked on this stairs all are agreed all will be implemented immediately but there is one condition the condition is school started its journey with 50% results and now reached 98.5% results but my expectation is 100% so teachers should put all the efforts to ensure that the next year the result will be 100% and when you achieve 100% i will make it a point to come here to congratulate you all again i came to know about the standard of your school on the first day of my joining itself during the republic day celebrations the parade by your team was excellent i am glad to know that our education department is doing many innovative and creative things that ensure proper education to each and every student and bringing many laurels to the come to the company see naively has having good reputation as a good educational hub when i got selected as chairman and managing director of nlc in it daily i was meeting important bureaucrats in the ias cadet as a cadet i am proud to say that out of the ias officers which i met there many people are having links with naively many people were telling that we studied there many people were telling that they have some link with naively and they were well welcoming me with many proud and honor that is really great
today we experience the learning through virtual reality classroom it is really excellent way of teaching we are thinking we missed a lot during study time because at that point of time our teachers they used to struggle to explain us the concepts we have seen the concept of functioning of heart it was so nicely explained once it is seen by a student he will never forget in his lifetime but my request to all is that whatever infrastructure we are having whatever facilities we are having unless we use them properly there is no use of such infrastructure so i request all the teachers and hm madam to ensure that all the students all the 2000 students are having proper advantage by using this virtuality lab i remember the words of dr abdul kalam which are most relevant here i am born with potential i am born with greatness i am born with wings so i am not meant for crawling i will fly i will fly this you have to realize the importance of this statement you are having all the potential to become a good citizen to lead india to developed country status i understand that our education department has planned to renovate certain existing infrastructure in among the schools to provide some additional facilities in all the schools to further enhance efficiency and effectiveness surely all such proposals will be considered favorably based on its requirement and benefits derived let me conclude with one tirukura kedil vidichalvam kalvi oru varkam maadalla maatrai evai i wish i wish all the students every success in their studies and extracurricular activities and for a bright future in this regard i just want to remind all the students there are a lot of opportunities in this school not only in studies in all extracurricular activities in the present dynamic world studies excellence in studies is not only sufficient you have to develop in all areas all round development is required whenever you complete your, your education and go for job the recruiters they see not only studies all your skills so my request to all the students is that you should put all the efforts in excelling in all areas gaining as many skills as possible like the communication skills which i have seen here and all type of all round activities sports you should focus on all the activities properly balancing them so that you can excel in future once again i wish all students every success in their future endeavors remember one thing whatever you are learning now that is mainly because of this teachers their selfless sacrifices in teaching you in imparting you proper education without any self advantage so on this occasion on this diamond jubilee occasion i request all of you to give standing ovation to your teachers and headmistresses 
for their selfless, dedicated working for the school. Okay, thank you, Nandri Vanakkam. management side 500 rupees each to each student and the teacher supporting them thank you keep it up